So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. A nap? Please, we party down. Well, I gotta get going. Thanks to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya. Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. I need to unwind. Check out the strip. I'll think on it. Just in case, please allow me to provide you with credits for the purchase of any party supplies, Commander. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait. I am in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? All right, but if and when I decide to have a party, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Right. No promises. I'm gonna go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Thanks, Glyph. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. Miranda, good to see you. How do you like the place? Not a part of town I'd normally associate you with, Shepard. I like it. Or fix me something while you're back there, would you? Sure, I got just the thing. So what brings you back? I was hearing some confusing reports. It sounded like you had lost your mind. No doubt. My communications were hacked, among other things. I'm sure the news had a field day. <laughs> it did. So, a clone? Yeah. Saw it myself. Did you know anything about this? Just rumors. Nothing really caught my attention. But about this Brooks... Heard anything? Not as Brooks, but as Hope Lilium. Another lie, certainly. When the Collectors showed up, she put together the dossiers on your crew for the elusive man. Never paid her much mind. Interesting. My focus at the time was bringing you back. We needed the real Shepard, not some cheap knockoff. I mean, really. A clone? Yes. Hard to imagine. I'm not sure the galaxy could survive two Shepherds. Think of the property damage. Oh, they shut down my favorite sushi place. That's a shame. Shepard, you didn't. I did. Fell right through the fish tank. 
How did you manage that? It exploded. Hey, it was the clone's plan, not mine. Blowing up a fish tank shouldn't be part of anyone's plan. Although executing marine life seems to be some sort of hobby with you. No wonder your clone couldn't resist. It was the first step in taking over my whole life. We stopped it. Good thing, but why did it want your life? Why would anyone? All that running, jumping, gunfire. It's crazy. I'd describe it as engaging rather than dangerous. I'll drink to that. <laughs> trust me, I know all this isn't normal. Speaking of trust, with all this clone business, how do I know you're the real Shepard? I don't know, you just do. Do I? That's the trouble with clones. You can never be sure. Come on, you rebuilt me from almost nothing. Don't you recognize your own handiwork? It's not as if I carved my initials in the corner. Well, clone or not, I'm the only shepherd left. Good point. I guess I'm stuck with you. I do have a crazy life, don't I? That you do, my friend. That you do. Hey, Lola. Nice place. Might not look so nice after throwing that party you were talking about. You wouldn't trash my new apartment, would you, James? Me? No. Never. <whistles> nice view. But this place, it's just so... not what I'm used to. Which is? I grew up on the beach on the Pacific, so, you know, water, sand, real air. You miss it? Yeah. And the people. So, what's her name? <laughs> no. No. I stopped fraternizing when I joined the military. The two don't seem to go well together. Hasn't stopped you from being a shameless flirt. Yeah, well, that's just my way. I don't mean anything by it, Lola. Too bad. Ha! Who's the shameless flirt now? So you can give it, but you can't take it. No. I just... You're my commander, por Dios. <laughs> I can never tell if you're yanking my chain or not. It's my job to keep you on your toes, Lieutenant. Any way I can. Huh. <laughs> job well done, then. Good to know I haven't lost my touch. I assume you had a reason for coming to see me? Oh, shit. Right. I wanted to show you. What do you think? Looks good. And you've earned it. Now the real work begins, right? Exactly. And I heard what you said before. And I'm in. Cien por ciento. Glad to hear it. Anyway, that's it. Just wanted to show you that bad boy. I gotta get back to the Normandy. Esteban wants my help working on the shuttle. Thanks for coming by, James. This is gonna be a perfect place for a fiesta. Hasta la vista, Shepard. Catch you later, Shepard.
enjoying your shore leave, Javik? I have been asked to take part in a feat. I am told it is a great honor and will boost morale for the war. Who says it will? Ah, Commander Shepard! I didn't realize you were coming too! Perfect timing, perfect timing. You can play yourself. Attention! The Prothean is on set! Someone tell the stunt double he's been demoted. We have the real Shepard now. All right, places everyone. Quickly, quickly! Cue the backdrop. Roll cameras. And... Action! Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. The urgent hour of doom which we all urgently face draws near. Urgently so. But there is hope. The Council understands you recently found a Prothean in a refrigerator and defrosted him. So, are you guys just making this up, or what? Of course not. A writer wrote it, so it must be true. Ah, you die now! Not yet! That line comes later! The Vorcha Counselor will kindly refrain from further interruptions! I believe I have been misinformed about the purpose of this vid. Now then, O oh wise Prothean Elder, what wisdom of the ages can you share with us? Solarian kidney is best served at room temperature. It is even better when the Solarian is still alive. The fear adds spice. Prothean no like you! Did someone say Prothean? This one is familiar with enkindling. This one has enkindled multiple females across the galaxy. Blasto! About time you showed up! The galaxy is under attack by Reapers! If only someone had warned us about them years ago! This one tried. This one was ignored. This one's efforts fell on obstructed arms. Uh, actually that was me. Sovereign. Saren. You might have heard of them. Yes, and Blasto here destroyed half the Citadel putting them down. But even he's just one Hanar. And now we've asked Commander Shepard and his Protean partner here to assist. This one did not read that far into the script. This one does not share top billing. Wait, what? But it's Blasto 7. Blasto goes to war? Think of the children. In my cycle, your kind were nothing more than appetizers. Would you prefer to be boiled or fried? Protean, no like you! This one has found his motivation. Very well. Commander Shepard and Prothean partner of undetermined ethnic origin. Welcome to the Spectre Club. I've been in the club for three years now. Correct. But you are not an Ultra Spectre Elite 4000 Deluxe. This one is a 7000. This one has less recoil and faster load time. Where is the airlock so I may throw you out of it? We don't have a prop for that. They cue the sound effects. Change the backdrop. Look! It's Sovereign Half Brother Sluggard! And he's looking for some payback. Cue the stunt double! Your line. Say your line. Oh, you die now! Oh no! The Vorcha Counselor is indoctrinated! This one is the hero of the Citadel. This one has an incendiary projectile with the Counselor's name on it. Vorcha Uh, this one is the hero of the Citadel. I'll handle it. This one insists. This one doesn't care. This one wishes he was still frozen in a refrigerator. May we go now, Commander? Strike the set! Tell casting we'll need a new Vorcha. Prepare for Blasto 8. Blasto cures the Genophage.